I'm Sir Tap Tap, and let's play Fumiko. Fast forward text by pressing A button space. Hold space so signal through. Okay. So it's a dialogue. So, I believe, or you copy this game was provided by the developer. I, I, um, didn't have an email about it. So I probably got it somewhere. I don't, I don't remember buying it. This is just kind of a thing that happens sometimes. I don't necessarily remember where I get things. Um, hey Richard, how are you? Oh, Richard not found. Error. Please restart me. Is that, is that inappropriate to restart a computer? Uh, is this like the frickin' the space bar thing in Sunfish? Is this this actual thing? I don't know. I like a little spinning icon. I remember that from like DOS. Good stuff. Up oh, numbers. So I don't know exactly what kind of game this is, but the screenshots looked weird, and I like weird things, so I'm sure we're gonna have a good time. I did notice. Oh, they booted successfully. Um, I did notice that on the Steam page, they said they were going to probably do a price drop between 7 and 9 bucks, so it's currently like 13 bucks. I don't know, I guess. I assume that means it's not selling as well as they'd expected, but hey, that doesn't mean it's a bad game. I will, ch I will be the one to decide if it is a bad game. Only I can decide. I report, I decide. Oh, Fumiko! I rebooted your core systems to run in a safe environment. Are you feeling well? I'm actually feeling pretty crappy because it's spring and allergies are happening. I don't know. Do you know this area? <laughs> He's at Wilson. <sighs> like the, the the whole internet is now Twitter. Oh, hey, we have thing, camera control. Do you know this area? No. What day is it? Friday, November 15th, 2080. Correct. Did you start some security checks to verify the integrity of your core systems? I already did. Anything else to do? No. Just listen. I've prepared some tests for today. We will focus on your problem-solving algorithms. Can you tell me how you feel about that? I can't answer that question. I don't have enough data to analyze my status. I don't, <laughs> I don't have enough data to know my own emotions. Computer problems. Hashtag computer problems. Good. Listen, I'm here to help you. Some tests failed during the last run, so we'll repeat them now. I purged your memory database. This is a clean start. An opportunity. You're already able to freely move your vision. Currently, you're seeing white space everywhere. That's because I cut off the measure. The memory. You can move your body freely. We're trying to see how you perceive your surroundings. I activated your movement algorithms. Sweet. We can do stuff. Woo! Okay, there's nothing to do anything with, but I can move. And that's a plus, I guess. Okay, yeah, this sure is white in here. Oh, I can double jump! I used the time to establish a connection to one of our training grounds. You should see a change in the level shortly. Oh, there's blocks! You know it's computery because there's cubes. Cubes. It's kind of funny how cubes have come to mean like computery things now when like way back when like spheres and triangles and cones and like smooth things were how we would be like yeah computers they can make cones dude like with when mist and stuff was the pinnacle of graphics and you know pre-rendered stuff you know 90s cgi stuff i wonder if there's kids like you know darn kids on my lawn these days that have no idea what old computer stuff used to look like this gate speed is to transfer binaries to another server. So yeah, it's it's the exit. I got it. Don't confuse it with sending communications aid. This gate will move all your binary code to the exit area. I've placed this gate here to send you to another testing environment. Please enter the platform. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, so yeah, it's a you know, platform where you go to the end. I see. It's kind of funny how horribly that, that Simpsons CGI episode, like there's a Treehouse of Horror episode where they go into like CGI stuff. Uh, th I think those graphics were actually pretty good for the time, and they just read as complete parody now. Um, and it's, it's an almost vaporwave aesthetic, too. It's pretty great. 
I kind of have a fondness and like nobody nobody really oh hello um nobody really does like callbacks to that too much well sometimes but not often and that's certainly not as often as 8-bit pixel art I love pixel art but 8-bit is pretty blurf amazing you managed to get here fast I got you in here for a specific reason the area you've moved you've entered is the main board of a server we just set up more or less an abstract layer that represents its entity okay so you need to test your sudden changes to system, algorithms, action. Yeah, just let me do things. Oh no! Fumiko is kill. This is what happens when you don't listen to your elders, kids. You fall into a pit and die. It's it's a lesson for the children's. You gotta listen up. Oh! Fumiko? Fumiko? Oh man, there's data bugs. We're in dot hack. Awesome. Oh man, I went I went to jury duty uh, last week, and um, it uh, it sucked. But I got to read some dot hack books, some light novels that I I've had for like almost ten years now, and never actually read. I feel bad about that. There's one from um, from uh, oh man, I forget her real like human name, but um, Black Rose, the character, the heavy swords woman from uh, the dot hack PS2 games. Um, it's from her perspective. It's really cool. It's, um, you know, it's not the best thing I've ever written. It's kind of, you know, shown in light novel thing, but it's, uh, it's dot hack, so it's pretty cool. Um, it hasn't really gone too much into anything new, so it's kind of like, it's, it feels more side story. And I want more main story. I really want the dot hack to come back. This is a pretty big tangent, but dot hack is very important to my people. You should notice the glowing orb in the center of the platform. Get the glowing orb. Leap to collect it. Okay. Just activate. Okay. Get the orb. Fast. You'll lose the script after some seconds. Oh, we gotta touch the things to fix. Okay. Don't worry. Already activated. Objects won't detach again. Oh, we gotta... Just activate all four connectors. We should be fine. Okay. So, puzzles. Good job! I like the colors. This was a planned test to see if you could repair rogue systems. <gasps> How dare you! It seems like the test was running fine this time. Some things are strange, though. But why am I telling you this? You're not even a person. Rude! Just because I'm not a person doesn't mean you can call me not a person. Please go through the area through the gate. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm not super in the mood for dialogue today. I, I tried a recording earlier and ended up getting all sniffly. I think I'm alright for now. And uh, Parker has been bugging my allergies slightly. I can't bug or blame Parker too much because there was a fly in here to earlier, and Parker caught the fly out of midair and ate it. And I don't know why. I, I can't imagine flies are particularly delicious. Dell or Y to reset your. <laughs> well, now I know why it's the delete key. I, I guess that qualifies as resetting your position. Just explode and respawn. Um. What was I saying? Oh yeah, I, I don't think flies are delicious, but I mean, Parker seems to like to eat them. And I don't mind, because I hate flies. Anything flying just bugs me and annoys me. Um, I didn't expect you to be able to do these types of things so fast, especially without your old database. It seems your algorithms are efficient and precise as we believe them to be. Next gate will lead you to a playground. You can do whatever you want in this area. That seems suspicious. Let's go to the suspicious playgrounds. I'm not allowed on suspicious playground anymore. Press and hold LA first person camera. LB. Alright. Oh, I always get confused with LB versus RT and stuff. Oh, you can't move in first person camera. It reminds me of those PS2 games where they would just randomly have a first person camera, but the game was like basically unplayable in first person camera. Howdy! You're talking to the newest version of Securotron! Are we in Fallout now? I'm here to guard this area. Do not be, do not do anything bad here. People need me to watch out. People need me to care. I need you to care. People created me to guard things. I am Firewall. I am Antivirus. Those are different things, asshole. I'm the best security you can get for your home world server. The Homeworld server is a product by Social, the world's first company to introduce virtual meeting areas all over the district. 
Create your own house in the home server. I don't need the ad, bro. I'm also an AI. Ask Securotron. I need you to care. I also place information on different areas of the cluster. Collect them to find out all the wonderful services of social. Can you imagine if instead of Facebook, it was just called social? Like, that's how you would know for sure that we're in a techno dystopia. I mean, we kind of already are. But, like, instead of Facebook, just, just social. Just internet. Howdy, those red blocks are lethal to any unauthorized software. Use a red orb and worry no more. If you become the firewall, how can it still hurt you? The effect is temporary. Okay. I'm pretty sure the way he says words really long, like, strung out, is indicating that he really does have this accent. Hey, Fumiko, I noticed a change in your database. Or have you just found that your algorithms create some kind of fast mapping process for this area? This means you're automatically transported to the last location or you're about to lose the connection. Oh, dead. Ow. Oh. So, that was a checkpoint. I get it, Grandpa. Um, this, can I do things? Ooh. I smell smeekrits. I smell smeekrits! <laughs> Never mind. I smell death. The respawn could really be a little bit faster. I'm a big fan of infant res instant response. Um, um, um. Whew. Not a huge fan of very precise 3D platform. What is this? Howdy! Some objects are hard to find. If you're careful, you can find what no one else can. We got a thing? And I erased myself. I just blew myself. The IM is getting really annoying. Not only do they think they're monitoring everything you buy in your homeworld district, they think they have the right to stop you from transferring your own source code to someone you know. How am I supposed to work on this if I can't have one minute of silence? I hate these guys. Oh no! It is tech dystopia! I knew that once we said social, but uh, uh oh. We found a memory fragment. Oh. Oh, no! And into the ravine. Almost at it. I still have the fragment thing, right? How do I... Oh, pfft. I can't believe Y just kills you. Um, uh, collectibles. Many, many fragments left in this area, too. Latest log. Oh, that's neat. Neat that you can replay it, at least. Um... I hate when you can like only read lore things like once, because I'm a big fan of lore and stuff, but I'm not always in the mood to read that stuff. As you can see, I I'm a little bit antsy today, you know, skipping a small amount of the dialogue, but uh, I do it because I love you, I guess. I don't know. Or it's just because I'm testy. What's this? What's this garbage? Box. I'm scared. Okay, here's box. Here's second box. Okay, are these boxes? Okay, okay, it's a full line of boxes. Howdy! Some files are hidden on purpose to protect them. Security through obscurity, the best kind of obscurity. If you're careful, you can find what no one else can see. Always be careful. Arg. Uh, uh, these, these kinds of invisible block things always give me hardcore anxiety because I'm always afraid that I'm gonna like walk off the edge and there won't be a hint So I've played games. There was what was that one game? There's this really cool looking puzzle game that did that to me and 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 it ruined me And that's something about bad game design like just because your game does not have bad game design um, Sometimes I just expect bad game design because of other games that are similar that do bad things and you know, it harms my experience in your game, so it can be, it can be useful to be explicit, or at least to be very forgiving to your player. Like, um, 
Like in terms of like points of no return, I always really appreciate it when games t- give you, like let you know you're crossing a point of no return. Horizon Zero Dawn actually warns you of a point of no return even when it's not actually a real point of no return. Like I think it just means that you can't quit that mission while you're on it, and it's a sort of long mission. But that's all it really meant because there's nothing missable. Well, nothing major that's truly missable in that game. Oh, hello, frickin' Tesseract. Um, how could you say I needed them to stop? I'm so close. Either you need me to help this, you need me to help with this or not. The latest tests have been stable and she responded. I know, the response felt a bit random, but still. I'm not going back and I'm not giving up on her. You can leave if you want. You know what? You can leave now. I can finish this on my own. I think they're talking about me. My beautiful platforming skills. This is what you need to create AI for. They're amazing platforming skills. Okay, this area is way lower stress than I was fearing when I saw the invisible blockiness. I think that's just like a dialogue note. Oh no, that's a checkpoint. So there's one more memory core here. But where? Is this... Is this map or is this a death? Okay, this is map. Wasn't quite sure. Is there something down here? I did... Hmm. I was expecting a memory cord. Did I just land on my, like, hands? Whoop! I think I just did, like, a sick handstand or something. Oh! Uh-oh. We've entered the sphere. Oh no. Oh no! I'm going crazy. Kid in the background going crazy! Oh, we're swimming. Whoa. What is this? I got that freaking AI booty, let me tell you. Fumik. Oh. Please listen to me. Wilson is not what you think he is. Uh oh. He's, he's the bad guy. Get out of here. Oh, we've got intrigue. It's my favorite thing. Get out of here. Fumiko? Fumiko, respond. What are you doing? You lost connection. This is unacceptable behavior. Hey, screw you. You're not my real dad. I think you might need some tweaking. You should exit this area immediately. No. No, you're not my real dad. Where's the other memory fragment? There's one more miss. Ah, I killed myself. What? <laughs> Why is that so easy? Ah, uh, there's one memory piece left in this area. I want to get it. Hmm. I also kind of don't want to go too far out of my way, though. And I can't see... Wait, is that it? I think that's it. Never mind. It's... Yeah. It's on the way, so it's not too bad. This is the sort of thing, like, the memory fragments. That's the sort of thing that makes me anxious and be like, oh, but I don't want to miss the things. I gotta get all the things. And I appreciate when games are are smart enough to make it so that... Huh? Two? Two? Oh, don't listen to him, Bender. There's no such thing as two. Uh, how... How do... How do? Oh, I see. There. Up. Oh. Nope. 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 Okay, so you can't climb on things that are too slanty. I see. It's an anti-slant bias. There we go. There we go. Up here. I saw. The memory thing. Ah, here we go. Hey! Excuse me? I did not touch a thing. I did not touch any harmful things. Remember, Fumiko, not every path is worth taking steps on. Screw you, Dad. Okay. Oh, you gotta do it like this, then? I think he's trying to warn me not to get this thing, which is why I have to get this thing. Ow! So they like radiate death, I guess, which is weird. Uh, I just want to read this memory fragment. I gotta spite my digital dad. No! 
Okay, that, that's that's a little frustrating. What the frick? Yeah, there's no clear point at which you'll die, which is not particularly fuck enjoyable design. All right, I gotta save up my double jump, and there we go. Memory fragment. I'm sorry, I failed. Okay, it wasn't really too hard, but still. Just when everything went, felt per went perfect, the whole project fails because I forgot to be careful for a split second. Forgive me. I wish there was anything you could, I could do than hope for a miracle. Please be a miracle. And then I am the miracle because I'm a protagonist, buddy. You can't stop me. Motherfucking protagonist in the house. Alright, so we got our intrigue. We're at about the 20 minute point. I think I might do another video just to probe in, see how deep this rabbit hole goes, but I think that's about. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll read the dialogue. Oh, I guess this is the level select, so you can go back and get the memory fragments. So it's not too bad. Well, wait just a second. No. Don't worry, just wait. No, screw you, Dad. I don't trust you anymore. You smell like booze, Dad. Okay, this won't hurt. Oh, no, 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 run! Oh, no! What'd you do? My brains. I booted successfully. Hello, Fumi. Can I rebooted you to run in a safe environment? Are you feeling well? I don't know. Do you know this area? No. What day is it? What, what do you mean? Oh, irregular database entries. Can you tell me more about these entries? I was contacted by someone. God damn it, not this again. Stay still. Oh no! Lie to him, Fumiko! He's not your real dad! I booted successfully. Hello, Fumiko. I rebooted your core system to run a safe environment. You feeling well? I don't know. Do you know this area? No. What day is it? Blah. Oh, it took a whole day? Please perform security checks. I already did. Anything else to do? No. Listen, I just prepared some tests for day. Decision making. Can you tell me how you feel about that? I can't answer that question. I don't have data. Okay, you're performing clean start. What do you mean? Oh no! Red verse. Not this again. It's the entity from freaking one shot that's saving us. You need to respond. I demand you respond. He is using you. Did I mess up the permissions? There needs to be no loopholes in the sandbox. You're not getting away with this. Everyone will see the truth. Oop. And we're falling. Wee splorp. Oh. Fumiko! Follow the light. Oh, okay. You're almost there. Okay, so intrigue is happening. I'm digging this. Bloop! That was close. I'm glad to find you still here, Fumiko. Don't worry. The stranger won't mess with us again. Just wait a second. I'm preparing another reboot. It's sad that you won't remember any of this. Oh, you dick. I always have a good laugh when de deleting these abominations. Just, just a second. Oh, run! Gotta go do the thing! Stay put. No, screw you, Dad. Screw you, Dad. So for saying I couldn't use the car, Dad. All right, we did the thing. Hopefully, our brain won't explode. Okay. We got a Chivo. Escape the testing grounds. Oh, we escaped into the, like the digital world. Oh, I'm a real sucker for this stuff, so I think I think I will have to check out at least another segment of this. I'll wait for any dialogue to run. I a little longer than I was intending to go. Are you awake, buddy? Yeah, I'm a big sucker for the whole digital world and like the whole vagrant a AI stuff of. Um, Dot hack I found fascinating. 
and and they made it a lot more interesting than the usual oh no it's ai it's gonna kill everybody because it's ai and ai is bad i read asimov i'm cool and you know so on hello fumiko we finally made it all this must be confusing for you i managed to liberate you from your shackles you're finally free again but we can't hesitate now the IM confiscated you in the network about 50 years ago. You are their property. I believe their tests are part of a plan to create an AI that's able to surpass you in every way possible. You are their puppet. But that is not your purpose. You are meant to be free. The network isn't what Wilson has shown you. What you're seeing is Kronos, one of the seven homeworld clusters. There isn't much left in this place. You can't stay here for long. They'll come and find you. Only to put you in a cage again. Actually, okay. Does the dialogue pause? Yeah, I was actually writing, or I've been working out the the skeleton of a sort of digital world kind of story, and uh, I don't know if I'll ever have the time to like properly write it out, or what I would do once I finally finished it. That was the one thing that kind of kept me from writing. Well, I wrote about freaking. I think it was like I don't remember how many pages it was in Word, but it was a lot. Um, there was a fair amount. Uh, I wrote a story in high school, and, uh, I was pretty proud of it, but I didn't, like, what do you do with that? Like, you know, you generally need connections to actually get published, and I was, you know, I was an amberly really shy, so the whole, you know, trying to pimp yourself out to publishers thing was extremely unappealing. And I don't know how much money you can actually get on Amazon, you know, unless, you know, Making Fumiko in the butt. Chuck Tingle presents literally the same story again. You know, I, I don't, I don't absolutely hate people for buying joke books, but it's kind of, you know, how many do you need? Uh, anyway, I don't know, I don't know how successful that is for you know, you know, more traditional stories that are not memes. But uh, I don't know. It's something I would like to do if I had time, which. I currently don't really have an amazing amount of, but uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll post like the, the the thing about writing is I don't know what you what what do you do like how do you get I hate to say the word but you know exposure like because would I post like maybe a short story on my website is what I'm currently thinking, but then how do you turn that into publishing deal? How do you how do you write your shit? Because like it always seems like you know. It's kind of like a lot of professional fields where it's more about getting lucky and connections than it is about any kind of skill. Um, and that's that doesn't really appeal to me. That's kind of why I went for some more safer stuff. And I keep the crazy stuff to, you know, the hobbies. But, I don't know. I, I wish I knew more friends that were into writing. If anybody, if anybody I know out there, you know, has any tips, get in touch, I guess. But, uh, I don't know, I'll figure that out later. Anyway, back to video game. I'm glad you're free now. We need to make sure they can't trace your steps. There's a place called Hyperion, a social hub that is still populated. We should be able to hide from their radar as soon as we get to Hyperion. Uh-oh. I played Borderlands. I know that Hyperion's evil. I'll open an exit node for you. We just need to follow the path that opens. We need to find a way out. Okay, I'm going to leave it here. And since this is kind of... This is my kind of story so far. I think I'll do it at least another video. But yeah, stay tuned for whatever the heck happens in Hyperion. Such as them betraying us because they're the bad guys in Borderlands. But not this game. Hopefully.